Oh, all right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You at zero, then? Yeah. Medvicate, yeah. yeah. Zod, Jeb. Yes. Yes. Hi, hello. Hello, you at zero, Jeb. Hello. Zero's relative. I hate you. Three, two, one, play. So what out there prediction can I make today? No, don't be the fucking guilt. It's gonna be Caitlyn and Ronnie. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Is this how they met? Yeah, yeah this is how they met. They finally... Yeah, I don't know anything about this thing. I was hoping that you could fix that. Ow. Uh, yes. yes oh, is course. that? Ha have a seat. Oh. Thank That's you. why Frost smiled I then really when she her that. arm was burned. I know what you mean about Doctor Wells, though. Is brilliant. Oh, I cameo, so, cameo, cameo, cameo. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> oh, um, Her hair looks super unnatural. Like in the pipeline. I yeah. Mean, it must be incredible to wake up every morning knowing that you're building something that's going to change the course of scientific discovery for generations. Yeah, I guess I never really thought of it that way. I just this story's going to... I'm going to make my petition. I mean, ridiculously complicated. When she realizes this is funny, she's yeah. going to try and remove the black flame from Ronnie. Oh, yeah, obviously. I mean, Whoa. that means. Oh. Yeah, they're gonna try to off. save Ronnie, yeah, because. Why wouldn't Marcus they? is going, who cares? Oh, yeah, um, Marcus, he has a boyfriend. <laughs> they'll probably save Ronnie, but then Ronnie's still Death Storm. It's the Flash. It happens. Caitlyn can't get a happy ending. I don't even see the point in doing this. If they do what I've just said. Like, oh, it's Snow how they met, but it's like, we, we know about Ronnie. Come back anytime. <laughs> you gotta fill up that 40 minutes somehow. Hey, see? It's all, it's nice to know you're always there to fix me up. Yeah, that, uh, that's why they had that scene, for that specific line. Which yeah, reinforces your theory, Jeff. Oh, without you, you save us memories in the snow. I mean, if he knew that, he wouldn't need your help. <laughs> I think that's kind of the point. Ah, uh, it's loud. Oh. Dude. What? What? Ah, Jeb, I hate you. I hate Jesus you. Jesus Christ. Why? <laughs> this is my favorite TV show. This is my favorite part. <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> oh, yeah, this. <laughs> Where is my <laughs> What? That's more than time. Attack my the? mom. What are you talking You saw her grab her arm. She grabbed Iris. Her phone. Oh, well, unlucky. Yeah. Don't surely touch her. Dion Don't touch her. You're gonna. No. Dion surely could sense this, right? Should, yes. Why don't they alert Barry? Don't they have the phone alert? Oh yeah, that's why that's why she grabbed the phone and then it disappeared. That's fine. Never mind. What about Iris? Is fine. Um, I, she doesn't want to grow up Iris. It's probably in her, like on her back pocket. And uh, me too is a big thing nowadays, you know. Uh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh fuck! Looks like our not so friendly fire has been snacking on people's grief a lot longer than we thought. It's been ahead of us all along. Not anymore. Allegra, why are you a character? I'll say, yeah, if she died, I'd be so happy. Not before she, not before she fucks Chester. We need that. Yeah, that's gonna happen first. I want her to die while fucking Chester. <laughs> <laughs> I thought of making that joke, maybe, but I, I, I maybe. You know, found some restraint in myself, Madvicate, but I guess you... <laughs> oh, good for you for being the bigger, the bigger person. <laughs> it's Ronnie. Peter Parker? Yeah, oh, never mind. <laughs> Wait, what? What? Uh, say it's Ronnie. Just say it's Ronnie. Why didn't you? Why did you stop? They were at O'Shaughnessy's the night Frost and I went on our double date. Yeah, I remember that. He's been looking for me this whole time. Yeah, just say it's Ronnie. Because the fire Hi. is Ronnie. Hey, we did it. And he wants me to say hey, there we go. Thank Woo. God. Edgy music. <laughs> Thanks, subtitles. <laughs> 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 Uh oh. They're not gonna believe it. Now we're doing this, okay? Tell you people you've lost like it did with Chester's dad. That is actually a good point. That's hawking radiation. You can only pick up rads like that from inside a singularity. Ronnie died in singularity. Thanks for the flashback. On our wedding day. 
Hey, it's pretty neat. Why did you okay. say it was on your wedding day? Oh. The only one one Running, the Professor Stein came together, made Firestorm, and then separated in that thing. We... I... Thank you for recapping what happens in the show. I, yeah, we, we need every single detail, thanks. <laughs> I mean, if she already explained it, what's the point of the flashback? I don't know. But it still doesn't explain why the fire's been killing people, why it tortured Chester. And if Ronnie knew what he was doing, he would hate it. Which is why I don't think he's in control. When Ronnie died, his brain was flooded with ACTH. It's the hormone the human brain creates when it experiences grief. So maybe when he was reborn as a sentient fire, that same process gave him an overwhelming attraction to the same hormone. Because of some primal urge? That's I actually kind of neat. It it's a concept. Which is the quantum splicer? It's what made him firestorm in the first place. Bruh, am I gonna be right? Oh, fuck's sake. I am a CW Flash right now. This is Jab's audition for becoming a season 9 writer. Mm. <laughs> yes. Starchives. Ugh, that, I, no, fuck that name. Did he say that? Starchives? Yeah, subtitles are for sure. <laughs> oh, why? <laughs> All I'm saying is let's not jump to conclusions. About everything that's been happening and maybe just slow down this fire can manipulate people if it wants you to use the splicer if i don't ronnie will be burning like that forever ronnie's alive i i can feel it it's him are you gonna it's mention it that chester talking. also felt the same thing about his dad no just gonna not bring that up barry how about they just send like a city-wide notification saying if you happen to to come across a black fire just yell go to hell at it to make it go away <laughs> She's gonna tell Marcus the truth. Ha so no, don't do that. Working with the, the flash. Oh, she's doing. No. Ronnie has been unconsciously hurting the people around me. For your safety, I think we should stop seeing each other. Uh, there, there it is. One prediction now. <laughs> Until you get Ronnie back. Uh oh. That's even worse. My last few relationships have not been exactly healthy. Wait, what's wrong with Julian? Um, Harry Potter. <laughs> Makes sense. There is no morals. But it's your decision. I guess. And I'll respect that. Um, you know, there's this... <laughs> what? We play the plants grow their roots towards the earth. The people were, were heavenly plants. Our roots, they, they grow upward. Towards your heart. Okay. Those roots, they, they need to be cared for, tended, like any plant, or your heart will break before it even has a chance to grow. I have no idea what the fuck this is what? in reference to. What are you talking about? It just seems like a complete non sequitur. I th I think what? they just thought it sounded deep, so we're like, we'll throw this we'll no, throw it in there. I think it's foreshadowing for the end of the episode where they're gonna have to sacrifice Ronnie. I'm making sure your RNA is integrated into the sphere. If only you'd done that before, huh? Wouldn't that be cool? Yeah. Not putting the two of them in danger. Oh! What? Yes! Die! Die, die, die! Uh, oh my... Wait, what? Come on, I thought you were all about trusting the team now. This was really Ronnie. Why is he coming back now? Seven years after he died. It's just all... Feels... Too good to be true. So what? We just let her go through with this. What if it was Iris? And there was some dangerous experiment that would cure her time sickness. You'd risk everything to save her. No. Yo, no. 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 <laughs> no. 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 This guy's gonna get sucks. <laughs> okay, I can understand why he's getting sex. She's also sad. Yeah, she's also <laughs> pathetic. <laughs> Are you still alive, Chester? Brain damage. <laughs> no, I think he was recording. <laughs> are you retarded? Oh, they are retarded. What? Oh. Someone could actually build it on their own. Yeah, what? Chester, what? Doing? My cat killed my best <laughs> oh, drone. Okay, go back to the cat. My fleet of drones. <laughs> Wookie lover. Chester, that's great, but. What? How does he need telling this when they have super villains? 
remember when he said that he didn't what? want you to create George weapons because he was a pacifist because he almost killed his best friend. Yeah. And then now exactly. I'm just gonna show everyone how to build weapons on their own. That's fun. Also, he's like, I think supervillains are too busy watching my broadcast. Wouldn't supervillains want to know what a member of Star Labs is doing to like stop them? Yes. This is one of the stupidest things just... I've ever seen in my life. Chester, shut the fuck up. You're being a spastic. If you can't understand that technology can be used in the wrong hands, you are a spastic. Maybe all knowledge shouldn't always be so readily available. Whoa, that is a take. I never expected to hear. No, that's not. Oh. No, are you fucking dipshit? Does he not? Uh, he agrees with like encrypted communications, right? By logic, he shouldn't, because you're hiding the knowledge. All right, I'm back. What did I miss? Uh, Chester being an utter spastic that needs to kill himself. <laughs> yeah, they just continued yeah, huh. the, the scene uh, with Chester being retarded. And he, he said that uh, she thinks that knowledge shouldn't be that easily available because she thinks most people are bad instead of thinking, you know, the logical thing, but whatever. Chester has to be told that messing with life and death is a science experiment. Uh -huh. Well done. Oh. Wow. Well, done. well uh, not just this one. <laughs> Imagine going to the cupboard and they're like, okay, we've got to keep this technology secret in case, like, um, Rashi gets or something. But, no, you just said there's so many bad people. <laughs> Cisco put him in charge. Oh my god. Imagine Barry found that out. <laughs> Can't you just stop feeling it? <laughs> What the fuck was that shot? Notice how we didn't get a running noise, which is Barry walked there or something. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, just picked up the same radio frequency. The pain, there was so much of it. could sense his anguish. It felt like he was begging me. To do what? I mean, he was. Sex. We heard him say, set me free, so... I mean, <laughs> oh, yeah. you were gonna say, sex me free, I was like, what? Sex me free, yes, of course. I think that he wants to die. Oh. Where'd you get, you think he wants to die from that statement? It's what? Look, I know how hard this must be. What? But can, what? I'm almost positive about what I felt. I, I can't lose this expression right now, I'm very confused. He asked me to save him. Also, how does she know... Oh, well, never mind. Looking for me. Why have they got yeah. to this? Yeah, and the plan yeah, should so get him out. Wants... Yeah, the plan is to get him out of it, yeah. It's torturing his mind. Yeah, it's getting that's him out. We're yes. trying to separate <laughs> him with the mountain, yeah. Yeah, and then you take him out of hell, that is the point. <laughs> Which is what you're doing, yeah. So that we can end his yeah, but taking him. This isn't new information. <laughs> I'm so confused. What if Cecile's right? What? Barry, no. <laughs> Are you? Oh no. No, I'm actually on okay, Caitlyn's side on this one. It's I. Okay, I'm confused. Why is Cecile been like such a retarded character this season? She's never been good, to be fair. But she, what? Oh, she just said she was right. Yeah. A way to help him. Exactly. If you can help him, why would you even? When I had a chance like this once, when I went back to save my mom. That's not the same. That is not the That's same. Not the same thing. That's not the same, Barry. She actually has a chance to do it. This isn't a lie. What are you talking about? The thing is, this one is gonna end up evil and try killing people. Yeah, and Barry's but... gonna be right, and it's gonna be so emotional when Caitlyn is proven to be wrong. Yeah, this this one's gonna be Death Storm or fucking Black Storm or Evil Storm, <laughs> Cold Storm maybe. I don't know. No, I think but Black Storm. I'm fairly sure. I think they'll go with Black or Death. Ooh, Death Storm. That sounds edgy I think enough for this show. That's a pretty sick name. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, we'll go with Death Storm. To be fair, that would fit the name as well, given it's all around grief. Oh well, this scene was garbage. Oh, flashback, nice. Yeah, that's my kind of breakfast. Good, you're awake. Your vagina. I haven't been up 
this early. So what? Cisco made me oh, okay. Me. I get what you mean. Now. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, I remember that place when we had our first weekend away together. Oh, yeah, do you remember that uh, seafood joint on the corner? We have to go back to that. I do, and we will just as soon as you get ready. Glass did they put makeup on Caitlyn to make her look a bit younger? Yeah, obviously. Yeah, I was going to say, it does look like her. I mean, yeah, she looks good. Her hair looks off, but other than that, she looks... The, the, the makeup is good. Romeo Mel doesn't need it because men don't age. What's the point of this scene? Uh, it's to probably use Caitlyn's memories or something. I don't know. I mean, that scene just shows me, yeah, she loved him. Yeah, no shit, you married him. Of course you love him. <laughs> like, okay. I guess it was their first anniversary. Oh, no, 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 I know why. It's where they met. That's well, where the cl climax of this episode is going to be. You know, where they had oh, their first date and their first uh, weekend away. Thinking. Yeah, that was why. We're on this, you're mm. now on my wavelength. Yes. We're entering. <laughs> yeah. We've entered. We're now two flies on the wall on the writer's room of this show. <laughs> we are the CW co-writers. <laughs> Sky app. Sky app. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah so what, what the fuck are you talking about? Your mom touched Iris. Oh, it's too late. Now walk away. What do you mean walk the away? What are you gonna do? The fuck are you gonna do? You don't want to do this. What? <laughs> she can face through you. Are you retarded? <laughs> yeah. Thank you, show. <laughs> oh my god. Kill her! Kill her! Kill! Kill, kill Iris! Kill Iris! Kill! She's dead. What Please tell me she's dead. Her? Killed her. Exactly what I'll do to you if you ever try to find me again. Please tell me she killed her. Nah, she got taken by like Dion or some shit. Just wants to be released from whatever prison he's been in all this time. But then why did you say that you she wanted to die? We're not gonna let the fire kill anyone else. By killing Ronnie. And then Ronnie's pain. Once and for all. But You're kidding is Barry me, actually gonna try and kill? So oh, this no. is the same team that He's had a crying. debate about why whether or not you kill. Uh, Eobard Thon, the reverse flash, and they're like, ah, but Ronnie, you see him, we gotta kill. Are you fucking <laughs> kidding me, you retarded oh, fucking damn. troll. And this is not letting Caitlyn make her own call. Yep, which obviously contradicts his character in the last episode. Oh, no. Move, help Ronnie move oh, on. The all you have oh, is like a third hand account from. Can you at least um, try that? It's the seal who clearly has misinterpreted what Ronnie said because she uh, everything she says lines up with Caitlyn except that she added the he wants to die part. Oh, this is so stupid. Result in an endothermic explosion. He's not gonna try. All Ronnie wants now is to be at peace. Then he finds Caitlyn at his peace. So if he want, what? if he, all he wants is to be at peace, then he's not gonna try to kill anyone else. Then the point of trapping him is you, moot. It's like they don't. Do you think Barry of all people would side with Caitlyn because of Iris? Yep, considering, you know, the Savitar shit, yeah. To me, it's like clearly they're trying to go, Ronnie feels at peace with Caitlyn. I'll do it. She should hear it from me. I mean, yeah, of all people to talk to her, it should be you, but um, you, sh you should also have side with Caitlyn Frost. It is very out of character for you not to do it. I'm just like, it shocked these characters. Ago. <laughs> much for a romantic weekend away. I have big plans, you know, plans that does not involve us getting pneumonia. Oh, I had big plans too, all right. Yeah, oh, he was going to propose. Yeah, Sus was going to, yeah. Your grandkids get down on one knee and plan. You were going to propose? Yes. Oh, because she was going to propose. So I know you wanted to go to that bed and breakfast where we first fell in love, but maybe we need to stop trying to recreate the past. And focus oh, the that's why they okay, they wanted to have that line. Uh, okay. He was also gonna propose. <laughs> Great minds. My answer is yes, by the way. So is mine. <laughs> we need to talk. Barry wants to use the fusion sphere to help Ronnie die, and the team's on board. I just never thought you'd go along with it. Come on, Frost. Really worried, Katie. When Ronnie died. You and me weren't even you and me. I was still in your subconscious. But even then, I could feel your pain the moment you realized he was gone. Yeah. But as bad as that was, watching you pull away from everyone who loves you was even worse. And it's happening again. 
No. They're all turning on her because they're all retarded. It's not the same. Did you feel anything else? <laughs> Remember how happy you were before he died. Which is why I got this. But what about Barry? Sure, Barry's family, but... Thank God, this character. Yes, Frost! Yes, you were not assassinated. I'm so happy. Frost is the best character this season. You will never shut yourself off from me or the rest of the team, all right? I promise. Well, let's go find Ronnie. Okay, great. Search this whole damn city to find him. Day or night, rain or snow, or whatever. That's it. Rain or snow. Memories in the snow. I know where to find Ronnie. Oh, yay! I predicted a riot. Let's go, Jeff. CW flash riding. Oh, why are they having a supernatural code open scene now? Have you guys ever heard of the Legend 27? <laughs> the I Legend 27? I think the you... Legend 27. <laughs> I think you made that same joke when we were watching Agents of Shoot back. And they oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> I know exactly what episode where he would have done it. Yep. It goes yeah, along F -C -C with Chitauri. Yeah. Yeah. Something tells me that's Chester's hunger. <laughs> Chester's hunger? <laughs> he's looking for... You see, he's playing D&D &D with Allegra, but they wanted to make it authentic, so they went to the woods. Oh. <laughs> see? That's Chester's dad. Ah, yes. That's <laughs> the D&D campaign like, they're playing, to be honest. This is their version of Ghost Rider. Confirm. <laughs> Just as good as it is a shoe. Hey, Baron. Try no, take them out before you. You have super speed. Like Baron. I just trip. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if it, if Ronnie wanted to kill those people, he would have, wouldn't he? Yeah, right. they were there for a really long time. Yeah. Just standing. Flash. He leech just started screaming. No. Yeah, that's also a good point, Jeff. Looks like there's more Stop saying Freck. Really, really oh I don't think they're civilians. I think it's Katie. It's the first Flash. Flash. Oh no, Jeff. <laughs> not... That should dare be right about that as a joke again. <laughs> 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 Thanks, Frost. You're the girl. What did you do? You just destroyed our best shot at stopping this thing. Not a thing. It's my husband. Hell yeah, Get Katie. Fuck off, Barry. Jesus Christ. Please, Caitlyn, don't be retarded. Please don't have a stupid change of heart. Ooh, that delivery was not great. We promised each other we'd spend our futures together. Caitlyn, please. I'm keeping that promise. Yes. Yeah, it's the same thing yeah, that they use this, for this Firestorm. Yeah. This isn't gonna go well. Barry's gonna be right. I really hope he isn't because Caitlyn was 100% right throughout the entire episode. Are they gonna do it in the next episode or in the episode after? Let's go! Please don't be evil, please don't be evil, please don't be evil. Oh, it's gonna be evil, you know it. Yeah. Yeah, Barry looks concerned. He doesn't look um, relieved. <laughs> so surely uh, something's gonna go wrong. It's probably gonna be the end teaser for this episode. Yeah, and then mm. it'll... I think the next two episodes are a two-parter. Because it's 12 or 13, it'd be mid-season. There's still an occasional regularity in his amygdala function that I haven't quite figured out, but it should improve. Yeah, that's gonna... Mm. Yeah, that's a hint. That's a hint. Mm. <laughs> We know this show. Eight seasons of experience. Oh. No, 12 is already out, Joe. When is 13 out? S look, next week. I think 14 is going to be the main season finale. Because. Let me check the schedule. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Um. Sorry. I'll, s I'll say the name of the episode so you know that Jeb is right. But. It's okay. You were just. Yeah. To... yeah. That sounds great to me. And I can't wait to get to know him. I actually think the two of you are really gonna get along. Good no. Too, Chester. Fuck Allegra and Mrs. Chester. What? But he mentioned that maybe once, you know. No, seriously? Ronnie played D&D &D in college. 
<laughs> Once or twice. Oh, snap. We oh, okay. Did ever happen to chess or checkers? Dominoes. And that's a good game right there. Okay, Grandpa. Boomers. This is hilarious. <laughs> I'm laughing so much. But it's worth. I'm so sorry. Yeah, you should be. You're retarded. Yeah, you really should be. Like... So You're retarded. Okay. All that matters is that Valentine. Ah, uh, but she's gonna be right. I hate this fucking show. Yep. But yeah, the name of the next episode, Death Rises. The one after that is Death oh. Falls, oh and the one God. after that is oh Funeral God. for a Friend. So yeah, oh. Jabby's right. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Hi, uh... hey, Barry. Your wife's gone. Your wife killed someone today. Oh my god, that sound cute. That's... Okay. That editing was so abrupt. <laughs> Go to Coast City yeah. and uh, run around the city and make a sweep to find it. Hey, okay, the end. No, he's not gonna do that. Oh, oh no. Oh, whoa. Oh, boy. Here oh, no. Yeah, the next episode they're gonna we kill Ronnie. Panic button. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Oh, I'm just gonna kill myself. I I'm tired of doing every prediction right. <laughs> what? Did you read the synopsis I sent you, yes. Jeff, in DMs? Uh, let me check. Fuck. Oh, sake. Right. Did you hear that voice? I did. It was me. Cause that voice was mine. Ah, so close. Well, I knew you'd understand what I wanted, Kate, and that you'd build exactly what I needed. This sounds like a super villain monologue. You should uh <laughs> press wrong. that press that panic button. We need to get you back to the med lab. Wait, why are you? Uh, would you take it off? That makes no yeah, sense. Point. Maybe he's just caressing it because he likes it. <laughs> because I'm not Ronnie. Oh. Okay. Oh shit. Oh, wow. Whoa. Wow. Um. Uncontrollable, irreversible chaos. His death gave me life. On, Took you a while storm. to get here. Death storm. Something beyond death. Beyond Come on, death storm. I'm death storm. Death storm. Come on, you, you're not gonna say your Panic. name? Panic. Panic. Uh. Oh. I even did it! Oh, 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 oh my god! <laughs> what? Oh my god! I can't believe it! Again! Oh my god! How predictable is this show, I swear to god! <laughs> Get ridiculous. Uh, the funniest part of this show is just, you know, predicting the, the, how the retarded shit they're gonna pull. <laughs> I am a fucking so prophet cool. of this universe. <laughs> we compare Blind Manor, we compare this. Blind Manor, I was put in it because, hey, it's the only logical conclusion. But I say, I'm like, what's the most retarded thing that they could do? <laughs> Death Storm, let's go. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, that was great. Holy shit. Oh, my God. I'm so happy right now. That was so stupid. Another big CGI monster. I will say, I do like the Death Storm design, despite horrible CGI. Yeah, the design is pretty neat. It's got that over Pete Boy, at least. He's got a good design. <laughs> I I want to check. Jeb, did you see the release schedule? Because I think Funeral for a Friend is going to be the mid-season finale, but Into the Still Force is the last one that has a name, so I'm not sure. Uh, I'm actually going to... I don't think they're actually going to do like a break thing. Oh, which is why we. Can't... Oh, yeah, that's that could, could be right because they did the five episodes and then they waited to get back, right? Yeah, that's a yeah, good point. That makes sense. Yeah, because the last so... episode is uh in twenty ninth of June. I just checked. Yeah, so you're right. So we're gonna have uninterrupted flash every week now. Isn't that fun? Oh god. <laughs> Apparently, the finale of this season will tie all the way back to season six. I don't. I have didn't watch season six, but I imagine you're gonna be able to clear <laughs> everything up, Jeff. No. Yeah. <laughs> you have too much fun. Oh man. All right. So. Uh, yeah. Adventure. Yeah. Ronnie is isn't Ronnie. He is Death Storm using Ronnie as a vessel to trick Caitlin into, I guess, stabilizing him so that he can 
work properly. Uh, yes. And Barry was right, I guess, even though everything that Barry said throughout the episode was retarded. And now I'm like, this makes even less sense now with what Cecile was saying, right? Because Ronnie's actually dead, and Deathstorm wouldn't want to be dead. He would want to actually be saved and not be killed, not be put out of his misery. So yeah, Cecile was just completely wrong. So that's fun. But, well, you could have just been. It could have just been manipulation. But the thing you is, know, that pretending it, to be Ronnie. No, yeah, but it's one thing to pretend to be Ronnie. It's another thing to feel that you want to die. When her entire thing is to read feelings and not like read. Oh, mind. she read that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Then yeah, it was off. I thought it was just he straight up told her. I forgot no, which one. No, because it was. Uh, what he said was set help me and set me free. That's what he said to her with these words. And then she said she got the feeling that he wanted to be pulled oh, out of his misery. Oh, yeah, and then she pulled that out of her ass. Yeah, which it just seems like she, she was just, like, completely fabricating that because, you know, hate Bonner for Ronnie, she has, you know, it's been established <laughs> since episode one. No, but yeah, I don't know. That was super weird with Cecile, but, yeah. I am Death Storm. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> well, yeah, thanks for watching us watch this show. It is a lot of fun. So we'll catch you next week. What's the week. Death Fool synopsis? Um, Team, Flash Team Flash is under attack is... and each must fight to serve not only themselves but each other. To save not only themselves but each other. So based on the funeral for Fred synopsis, we kind of all like Bonnie is the one that has to surely die. But then I'm also like, that's so obvious that surely not. But it has to happen. I imagine but, it it will be Ronnie to die. I mean, yeah, Ronnie I is gonna die. Well, it's not even Ronnie, but Death Storm is gonna die soon anyway. But uh, the <laughs> thing is, it could they could kill off Caitlyn, but I doubt they would by this point because she's been in the show for so long. Um, but they do have like Frost, so Danielle Pennebecker wouldn't be leaving the show. So who knows? Mm. Um, who is even leaving? Is anyone Flash. leaving? This is the thing, no, I don't no, think no. anyone is. That's the issue. <laughs> so I don't so it kinda has to be money then. Well Unless they kill someone, they bring them back through some ridiculous idea. Which the show has done before. Yeah. Well yeah. Any, anyway, if you would like to see us predict this entire show as we're watching it, uh tune in <laughs> next week. It should be fun. <laughs> uh goodbye, people. Bye-bye.